All American Diner. Meet Super Special inside the restaurant. Do not break cover. Well, you know, you gotta practice your German more, man. You know, I don't know. You just gotta hey, buckle down and I don't know, this couple just... times. So, break. Americans, are you going to the concert tonight? Oh, Jeb here is. He's a, a big fan of DK for ain't Jeb. Well, it makes me happy. What's wrong with that, Wayne? Ain't nothing wrong with that, Jeb. I like your style, Americans. Very good. You're part of the Reich now. Subject of the Great Führer. I hope for your sake you consider the Reich and all its glorious people your own. Yes, of course, sir. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sure. Let me give you some free advice. You are witnessing a new dawn for America. You have a choice in this new world. Because the time will come when, how do you say, the wheat detaches from the chaff. Have you taken your German lessons? Oh, yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Good. You, how do you say thank you in German? Oh, of course, sir. Let me see. It's, um... Yes. Dank, dank. Yes, out with it. Dank, danky. <laughs> My God. <laughs> was that all right? No, that was terrible. You're butchering my beautiful language. It's Danke schön, verdammt. Say it. Uh, Danke schön? Incorrect. Danke schön. Danke schön? I've heard enough. No more. <laughs> I'm so sorry, sir. I'm still practicing. You will practice hard. Oh, I will, sir, and I am so sorry. Das sind keine Abschüsse. Die sorgen dafür, dass das Gewehr mir nicht wegrutscht. Ich habe Probleme mit schwitzigen Händen. Ich krieg Ausschlag an den Füßen. Was sollen wir mit Wollsocken? Wir sind doch hier nicht in Bayern. Mir gefällt's hier. Ein kaltes Bier nach Dienstschluss und die Welt ist in Ordnung. Hey, ich lade dich heute Abend ein. Die haben nur diese winzigen Ami-Gläser. Aber wir können die Blumenvasen von der Fensterbank nehmen. <lacht> Abgemacht. A newspaper? I got today's news for you right here, mister. Only one Reichsmark. Say, mister, you look familiar to me. Are you some kind of celebrity? Mister, you... My God. If you are who I think you are, I just want you to know I am behind you all the way. Look at you, people. Celebrating your own destruction. Just listen to that lovely marching beat. I'm so happy you Germans brought some culture to this country. Kamerad ne Neidner? Did I pronounce that right? You really must correct me if I didn't. Oh, d just a, a bit more practice, Frau Deinetler, and you will pass the test on changeover day with the highest marks. I just couldn't stand all that primitive jungle music they used to play. Jazz and rock and roll. Quite ver... ver Schrecklich, <laughs> like you would say, right? <laughs> yes, good, Fräulein Adler. You know, I see great potential in you. Your attitude is impeccable. <laughs> you flatter me, Captain. 
You are a lady deserving of flattery, Fräulein. <laughs> oh, stop. But I wonder one thing, Captain. Tell me. Why do you tolerate that awful band, De Kaffer? Those boys are Englishmen pretending to be German. I even stopped listening to Mozart when I heard he's not German at all, but some kind of impure Austrian. Now, Beethoven, <laughs> that is... Fräulein Edna, may I remind you that the Führer himself is Austrian by birth? And so is my grandmother. Oh, 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 I'm very sorry. I didn't mean to... To insult the Führer like that is... It's outrageous. I really didn't mean to... Be quiet, Fräulein. Your name will be reported to my superiors. Oh, please, please, no! You will be carefully monitored from now on. Do not step out of line again, or you will face grave consequences. Do you understand? Yes, sir. I... Quiet! Ich kann sie wegen der Parade. I caught my slave red-handed trying to steal from me the other day. That's terrible. Sie können hier nicht durch. What did he steal? Food, bread, potatoes, some bell peppers. You believe that crap? Susan was gonna serve it for dinner. The kids were all upset. Oh, bad. Having hoodlums in your own house would upset anyone. How'd you punish him? Standard procedure. I called it in. Secret police took him and his family away. They'll end up in the New Orleans ghetto, I reckon. No, oh, Jesus. How do these people even survive in there? Government ought to just burn the whole city to the ground and be done with it. Yeah, better not worry about it. Hey, we got a parade to watch. You bet. You look familiar. Meine Liebe, do you know how beautiful you are? <sighs> Stop it, you. Ich liebe dich, Alison. Ich liebe dich, Otto. on a date yet, but soon. You're invited, of course, Auntie. Oh, that's nice, dear. Give my regards to your father when you return to the farm. Oh, and tell him I'm putting some hard-working slaves up for auction this week if he's interested. There'll be cocktails. I'll tell him, Auntie. Bye-bye now. <laughs> Bye-bye, dear. Good day. Who would it be? Uh, I would like the chicken salad to go. Uh, no cheese, no onions, no dressing. Is there noodles in that? Uh, yes, but we could make it without if that's better. Yes, that would be great. Oh, and a piece of pie as well. Certainly. You can uh, take a seat down by the counter and I'll prepare your food if you excuse me. Uh, it would be great if it could be fast. I'm in a bit of a hurry. Certainly, ma'am.
took Mary Jane to see his recent style movie last night. Gee whiz, what a swell movie. The Fjord sure cleaned up Hollywood from all that depraved filth they show in the cinema. <laughs> now, it's much more wholesome. And what a hoot of a movie. You're in for a real treat. What is taking them so long? Why don't they open? Say, why don't we come again on Saturday? We'll make it a double date. You bring Mary Jane, and I'll bring Mandy. Uh, next weekend, maybe. I'm taking German classes at the library this weekend. No! Good. <laughs> a better spot closer to the parade. Wanted to get a real good look at the Panzerhut. Hey, why aren't your neighbors here? I haven't seen them in months. Sanderson's? One day they were just gone. House empty. Didn't even leave a note. Well, that's strange. Wasn't Dottie Sanderson's son in the army? You mean Michael? He died in the Normandy massacre. I see. Mrs. Sanderson was quite vocal about the way things turned out after the war, if you know what I mean. Oh, weren't we all at first? Then we saw all the good things the Germans were doing for this country, didn't we? Arthur got his old job back at the factory. Oh, I tell you, things were going to hell in a handbasket before they came in. Huh. That's the gods on this tree. What a parade. Here in our small town. A marvel to me. Papa Joe's All-American Diner. My kind of dive. Because you're a fucking Nazi traitor, uh-huh. But you I can trust. All those Nazi scum will die like boom! <laughs> you fucking assholes. What are you looking at? Fucking Nazi loving scumbags. Chase them out of this town. No, no. Planet. Then they can all burn together on some far, far away hellhole. <laughs> what? 